afternoon. It is a beautiful Saturday here in Santa Cruz and I just finished my first appointment which was an in-person live appointment of course with face masks and gloves and all the proper precautions um, of house touring which was fun. I miss house touring and now I'm going to go to my second appointment which is a virtual appointment and um, I'm going to do a, a FaceTime so it's kind of interesting to kind of mix things up a little bit and use our technology to serve our clients and um, just like I, I I get bored easily so I like having <clears throat> a different way to do business so that's pretty cool all right happy Saturday well this is something I haven't experienced in a long time traffic I think it's been pretty clean and clear sailing ahead for the last, I don't know, 60 days or something. So um, I'm having a new experience, which I'm grateful for because that means I'm out and about and that things maybe are picking up as far as um, being in the community again, which I miss terribly if I haven't mentioned it yet. I think I have multiple times. There's something so charming about old cabins in the redwoods. Look at this beautiful old clawfoot tub and it's surrounded by windows that look out onto the redwood forest right here in Felton. I just love it. 350 Andrea Lane and they've done a cute little job right here in this bathroom. Okay back to showing pro property less than virtually like in reality and check out these beautiful redwoods. And I was just driving up Highway 9 to get to Felton, which is a spectacular place really to go and to live. And uh, there was a tremendous amount of people that were hiking. And um, even though I think we're not supposed to do that, it kind of made me happy to see people out in nature and enjoying the beauty that surrounds us here in Santa Cruz County. Like we are so truly blessed to get to live in this county. Oh, technology. I had spotty cell service, so I, it was harder to show uh, that house virtually than I would have liked, but I think we got a good sense. At least I was able to put my eyes on it and give my clients good feedback. So now I'm off to my next appointment, which is a live appointment. Um, and, you know, there's really nothing that can replace a live appointment, but we do what we can. Okay, almost home, done with a full day of house showing. And you know, there's nothing that can replace a face-to-face -face showing interaction. There's just so much information that you get when you are showing a home in person to somebody that you just don't get virtually. So I know that we've shifted and we're doing a lot of business virtually, but in-person showings, um, they just are irreplaceable. And they also make me happy because I like people. So it was a really nice day to see people and to get out there and to work and to um, have the uh, do both virtual and in-person showings and get to see the difference and the reactions and how people engage differently and view uh, homes differently. So I hope you guys are doing well. I keep saying that. I'm doing well. I'm doing way well. And you know what I really miss? I really miss going out to dinner. And I'm driving down here um, on Highway 1, which it's stunningly beautiful right now. And I'm passing Moss Landing. And I really love Phil's Fish Market. And I wish I could go there with my friends and then go to the beach. And I really also love the whole enchilada. They have magnificent margaritas. So those are two things that I miss. And I can't wait until we can do those types of things again, which uh, if everything happens as in the time frame that they're saying this time would be June and that's two weeks away and I think I can manage. Here we are. We're gonna poach a driveway here. Look, make sure, make sure there's, the law is not around. It's got a little bit steeper than our driveway the longer as well. Looks like smoother concrete. All right, let's go. It's a top drop. Oh, oh, that's a scary one. You gotta, you gotta commit. You gotta, com she's gotta commit, folks. Waiting for cars. 
waiting for cars to go by. Here goes her first big drop in. First giant drop in out of a neighbor's yard. Oh! Okay, you got to commit. You got to commit. Step down with that front foot all the way. Ride it out. Front foot stomp and ride it out. Ah! She's not committing, folks. I had a problem committing when I was young. It took me six years to marry your mom. Take that drop. Step on it. Now, oh, you gotta lean in. Leaning back is just falling. Lean in. All the way, stomp that foot down. All your weight forward. Oh, 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 good thing it's not a half pipe. Let's try it again. You can also do a 50-50 draw, where you set your board sideways and then you just kick into it. Ah, just got the nerves, folks. You start higher, or it's not so steep. What a sick descent. Woo. Yeah, in the sun, in the hitting the sun. That's so cool, Kelsey. Did you make that we on the fun. lathe? Yeah. That's beautiful. What are you going to use it lathe. for? That's right. Kelsey's I think, first bowl. Yeah, this is my first one. I think it's going to be specifically for avocados. Oh, an avocado bowl. Yeah. Those will look good in there. I'll keep them nice and isolated from all my other veggies. Bitch. Oh, yeah. look, at, look, at, look at the signature. Oh yeah, for when I become famous, you know. Oh, I love or it. Or when if I have kids. Oh, I love it.